motif as a literary technique. Now, don't let the word throw you. Motif is just a recurring image, sound, action, or other figure, even a color that has a symbolic significance. It is a symbol that recurs multiple times in a story or a novel. And this is really important. It contributes toward the development of a theme. So it can't just be a random symbol somewhere in the story. It has to actually contribute to a theme of the story. So think of the colors black and white in Star Wars. Black and white is symbolic of good and evil. Luke Skywalker wearing white and he's the good guy. Darth Vader wearing black and he's the evil guy. And this contributes towards the theme of the battle between good and evil. So it is a motif. So Steinbeck in Of Mice and Men um, has an interesting technique with the rabbits and um, this theme of trying to achieve the American dream. So remember that the setting was in the Great Depression and you know everyone even today has this American dream to own their own home, have some property, um, live well and be happy. And during the Great Depression, that wasn't possible for millions of Americans. It was actually quite impossible to achieve that American dream during that time. So let's see it, look at the symbolism of the rabbits and, and see if, if they might be symbolic of something. And I'm going to suggest um, the hope for a, or dream of something and um, see if it works. So at the beginning, it's mentioned right in the very beginning. Rabbits come out of the brush to sit on the sand in the evening. That was page one. And then later in section one, we learn that, you know, they have this dream, this American dream of owning their own ranch and their own property. And for Lenny in particular, it's all about the rabbits. Um, and, and it even goes so far as to the end, at the end of section one, the last example that they, that he suggests they should have even different color rabbits and George sort of exaggerates with red and blue and green rabbits. So to me, the rabbits are symbolic of this dream or this hope to achieve this American dream of property and a home and rabbits. So in section three, it kind of starts to shift this. It starts to have a bit more of a negative to it. Um, George is talking to one of the ranch hands and he's describing the girl that got him in trouble up in weed. And he says, that girl rabbits in and tells the law she's been raped. The guys in weed start a party out to lynch Lenny. So here he's using the rabbit word rabbits to talk about how she moved, um, but it's in a negative way. And this is sort of one of these things that kind of stops them from achieving their dream. Uh, later in the same section, uh, Lenny asked George, how long is it going to be till we get that little place and live on the fat of the land and rabbits? I don't know, said George. So it's no longer like it's going to happen for sure. He's not really sure when it's going to happen. So not convinced that they're going to actually achieve the dream. In section three, it continues. Um, are you talking about the rabbits some more? Every 10 weeks or so, George continued, them does would throw a litter so we'd have plenty of rabbits to eat and to sell. So rabbits is this hopeful dream of Lenny's to have their own home. And George's, George sees the rabbits as something to achieve the dream, to eat the rabbits and sell the rabbits. A little bit later, it says, we'd have a setter dog and a couple striped cats, but you got to watch out. Them cats don't get the little rabbits. Lenny breathes hard. You just let them try to get the rabbits. I'll break their goddamn necks. I'll, I'll smash them with the stick. So here, it's kind of symbolic of, you know, you have a dream and, and people try to steal it away from you, like the cat getting the rabbits. Uh, and in this section, just after, this is just after Lenny crushes Curly's hand and... He's worried that they're not going to be able to have their dream anymore. Lenny smiled with his bruised mouth. I didn't want no trouble, he said. He walked toward the door, but just before he came to it, he turned back. George, what you want? I can still tend the rabbits, George. Sure, you ain't done nothing wrong. I didn't mean no harm, George. Even at this point, Lenny is starting to realize that maybe they're not going to achieve that dream. So... Literary, the literary technique of motif, remember, is a symbol that happens multiple times. It's recurring, and it can connect somehow to a theme of a novel.